in Blood Myth. Sure. I'm Rob Wainwright and I play the character of the Bosnian who uh, was uh, killed by Borman at the beginning of the film. Mm -hmm. uh, his background was never actually specified but I think um, given the time that Borman was meant to be in Bosnia that he was a uh, soldier of some description who just happened to be captured by Borman and um, met a uh, quite a grisly death. Mm -hmm. um, how did you get involved in the project? I knew uh, John from having worked with him on a student film uh, with Ian Outfield who was another member of the cast. Uh, it was about a uh, psychopath who um, shoves uh, objects up people's bottoms for uh, gratification. So only a slightly uh, less troubling villain than <laughs> one in this, really. Um, but yes, yeah, so Ian and I had a lot of fun on that, and then John asked if we wanted to play henchmen in a short that he was doing, which was called The Liberator, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, both of us turned up and, and had a lot of uh, fun doing that. Cool. Um, do you have a favourite memory of the shoot? Favourite memory of the shoot? Well, a cup of tea that you made me upstairs in the kitchen <laughs> was, was lovely, actually. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah well, I should explain, I mean, I was actually a bit um, disconnected from the, the rest of the shoot. I um, was asked by John originally if I could come on board um, for the uh, the shoot that was going on in the forest, but mm -hmm. um, unfortunately I was doing a play in London at the time, so I couldn't do it, uh, which was a real shame. Mm -hmm. But then he called me up probably, I guess, a month or two after uh, the main shoot had been completed and said, listen, I've got a small role for you in it. Um, uh, would you be happy to come down to uh, Ben Shockley's place and uh, just film? Mm -hmm. Probably take uh, an afternoon. Uh, so I came down and uh, just filmed in the basement of uh, Ben's mother's place, and um, yeah, it was uh, it was it was good fun. And yeah. as I said, uh, the uh, cup of tea that Ben made me afterwards was superlative. Loved it. I hope you're not going to say that's your least favourite moment as well. But that's um, the next question. No, no, no. <laughs> well, least favourite moment was probably uh, uh, John with a balaclava on his face in a dark <laughs> basement, uh, holding a machete to my throat, saying, "Don't worry, I'm not going to cut you." <laughs> <laughs> but simulating cutting me. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> and the, the direction, I believe, at the time was, uh, can you look scared? I didn't need much direction, really. Uh, John holding a uh, machete to my throat was, was enough motivation, really. And uh, what have you been doing since you filmed Blood Myth? Well, since then, um, uh, I actually went to San Francisco with John to do um, uh, a play with him at the San Francisco Fringe Festival. It was... Um, it was a production of, of something he wrote. It was a drama called Exiles. It was about um, English teachers in Saudi Arabia, based on his time there. Uh, and that was a huge amount of fun. I really enjoyed that. Um, this year, I've, I've been in a couple of feature films. Um, one of them was called Uncut, filmed in Chatham. Good place to film a horror film, really, uh, if you've ever been there. <laughs> um, it was uh, w uh, said to be the first thriller uh, actually shot all in one take. So we had to rehearse for six weeks beforehand, blocking it all out. Uh, like a theatre uh, production, then it was filmed all in one take. Mm -hmm. So that was good fun. I then went down to Southampton to do a, um, a feature called The Demon Within, which was shot by 24 character films. Uh, I was the demon within. Cool. And without and everyone else. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rob, uh, thank you very much indeed. Thank you.